Hello, this lesson is the first revision lesson on protein and is suitable for both Year 9 and Year 10 students. You will need a pen and paper. I'll give you one minute to do this. The Do Now activity asks, why is this man eating tuna at break time? Take two minutes to write down what you think. You should state that proteins typically will keep us fuller for longer. Carbohydrates burn energy very quickly and we will easily become hungry again. Take two minutes to read through the learning objectives. Keywords for today's lesson a high biological value HBV, low biological value LBV, amino acids, deficiency and excess. Make a note of these on your paper. I'd now like you to write down what you think protein is and why you think we need it in our diets. This will be a five minute exercise. Look at the slide and compare it to your list. If there's anything you've missed out, I'd like you to add it to your list, please. Moving on to types of protein. We know we've got HBV and we have LBV. Some of the amino acids can't be made in the body, therefore they have to come from the food we eat. HBV value proteins contain all of the essential amino acids. Foods that are missing one or more of the essential amino acids are called low biological value proteins. You should eat a mixture of LBV proteins to get all the amino acids your body needs. This is called protein complementation. Now complete this five minute sorting activity. Sort the protein foods into HBV and LBV. So how many did you get right? If you look at the key at the bottom of the slide, HBV is green, and LBV is purple. If you didn't get them all right, please make any amendments you need to now, please. Here we have a group of protein complementation dishes. Typically on the left we see beans on toast.
Now moving on to what happens if we have too much or too little protein in our diets. So that's whether there's a deficiency or an excess of protein in our diets. I'd like you to take 10 minutes to complete each mind map please. Thank you. You should have included that too little protein in our diets may increase appetite and promote overeating and obesity. It can cause muscle wasting and increase the risk of bone fractures. Severe protein deficiency can cause swelling, fatty liver, skin degeneration and stunt growth in children. An excess in protein in our diets can cause constipation. Too much protein from dairy can cause diarrhea Excess protein can also cause dehydration. So what if somebody was a vegetarian or a vegan? What can they eat? Look at these lists and make a note of them in your revision notes please on your sheet of paper. Finally, as a plenary, can you think of any meal ideas that these alternatives could be used to make? You have now completed the revision lesson on protein. Now read back through your notes you have made. Keep them safe, you will need them to revise from again before your GCSE food exam.